Ladies and gentlemen, editors alike, I have something groundbreaking to share with you today. Let's just hop right into it. So let's say I'm editing this, right? Normally, there's this dead space right here. But I don't want it anymore. I don't, I don't need this dead space. Normally, I'd cut right here. I cut my audio right here. I move it over. I do the same cuts over here. I would delete these tracks. And then I do a ripple delete. And that's how I get rid of the dead space, right? And that's not that's not hard to do, right? But it's I want more than that. Ladies and gentlemen, check this out. So, let's say I want the exact same thing, right? I go over here, same process. I realize I don't want this dead space over here, so I cut the beginning over here. But now Yeah. Yeah, let's see that again. So, all I did here. I move the playhead over to whatever is behind this playhead until that clip ends gets deleted basically when I press Q. That That's crazy. And you can do the exact same thing with the tail end as well. So let's say I'm editing. Let's say I don't want this entire section right here, right? I do the exact same thing, put a cut right here. And normally I'd cut right here, delete this, and then ripple delete. But why should I do that? When I could just make a cut right here and press W. 